Hi, and here we are in Gondor, and this is the last, I think, faction I'm going to do. This is the Mason faction, or well, last video I'm going to do of a faction anyway. Um, I've, I'm rep with all the rest of them. I've done all the deeds, and uh, Gondor needs your aid. Gondor needs my aid, and so this is the last one. Now you might be able to see um, Gondor needs to your the aid. right in my. Um, in my uh, um, inventory bag, there's a, a, a blue line of gear, and that is all the Hunter Liberator Army. You can see here, I only need the four deeds. But more importantly, if you look up just to that, I've got 12 gold pieces. Now, after completing this, I'll have 15 gold pieces. And as I'm now rep with the Swan Knights, or completed all the deeds, I can get the jacket of the Liberator, which means I'll have the full set of Hunter armor at last it's taken me i don't know how many days of grind to get it and i'll be doing a little video of that um afterwards so um which you know you can look forward to to see that yeah that's a bit of a beginner's mistake i went the wrong way i just have to say while we're um getting over to where we should be this is now i've you might have seen the library video i did um, when I said it's the hardest, here we go, nice edit there, the hardest um, uh, sort of solo instance I've done, this is by far the hardest one, this is this completely eclipses uh, uh, the library. And it's not just food, it's, I mean, there are a couple of bits that are actually difficult, but there are just so many mobs, there are just so many of them. I can't, you know, yeah, these three here, they're nothing, you know, they're, they're, they're nothing compared to what you're going to see soon. Um, I do what I usually do, you know, I'll take out the first couple and then in the end there's just so many, I'll just shoot one once and then I'll just cut and then they're dead, because this is no point and the video will take, you know, twice as long. And there's a strong horse there, Captain, and we'll just take him out. And, uh, yeah, so I'm quite excited to be doing this, as I said, um, when, when I did it. Getting the jacket of the Liberator it took me ages uh, to to get all the right coins and and all the all the gold and and get all the deeds. I actually for the um, for the warehouse deed, there's two more there. For the warehouse deed, it took me 16 days in a row to um, six, yeah 16 days in a row to actually uh, get the right deeds. I just got the same quests day in day out all the time so that was quite uh that was uh yeah really really annoying and there's some more mobs here and a strong captain next to them so we um just dispose of them there we are and now dispose of them Burn through quite quickly there. Nice. I've removed quick shot from my slots because my quick slot, because I just never use it, and I've uh, taken uh, split shot instead. And um, I've buffed up my um, AOE targets. And there are some more over there, and some more over by the door. So, deal with those. Now, it gets a bit tricky. There's a Corsair Captain here and a weak thug. That's fine. Take those out. There's usually two. It's just making sure there wasn't another one. Let's just kill those. Yep, nice and easy. Right, and now we're surrounded up the stairs. Three on the left. There's actually three on the right as well. 
And there's actually nine right ahead of us. And I kind of, as you can see here, make a bit of a mistake. <laughs> I have to... Yeah. It's nuts. Completely nuts. I attracted all of them, or what I thought was only all of them. So... Just have to dispatch of those. That was rather annoying, I must say. A bit stupid, though, as well. A bit stupid. I won't blame the game for that or say it's hard. That was a little bit stupid. I didn't really case it out well enough. So, go back up. And what happens now? And more over here. Archers as well. Very annoying. I feel... Completed the bands, just collect the loot. Completed one. And there are more up there. Six more up there, and there's some here. So, there are some tools, as you can see, up there. Just press delete, find out where the tools are. I have to recover the tools of the trade. Just make sure there are none up here. Oh, there's no way round or anything like that. Can't get to it up here. I can't. So, so you can't go that way. So stupidly, I thought I could just attract only three of them, and here they all come again. A great deal of uh, killing ensues. Those archers really, really hurting me. The bleed effects and everything. Really, really annoying. So, I would watch out for that if I were you. Really watch out for this bit. I just about managed to keep myself alive. I've got um, Hunter damage over time quite leveled up with some scrolls of empowerment. So, as long as I get a few of those off, a lot of the weaker mobs just kind of die from a distance. As they run down, I think I get about 600, 50 to 700 bleed every time. So that's pretty good. All right, last, just about pulled myself through that. And now we also need to find yeah, these tools. There's just a captain there. And another two mobs blocking my path. Oh, three, sorry. They're dead. Get the tools. And there's none more there, but there's two slavers. And I'm going to have to take those as well, because otherwise I can't get to the other set of tools that's behind the slaver. So, there's a yeah, see set of tools on the right, and I can't get to them. So... We'll, uh, and there was both of them gone there because, again, it would be all rather boring. And there were the slavers being horrible, but I'm sure that'll be another side mission to this, in able to uh, another deed, would be to take those out. And there's some more tools up there. And now we're coming to the single most difficult part, which is the snipers. Incredibly hard. Um, I've actually found a way to do this. Uh, if you want to know beforehand, is you kill one sniper and then run inside <laughs> the building and then go out again and kill the next one. Because I've tried lots of, you know, did lots of different tactics with barred arrow and stun and it doesn't work uh, I can't kill them all without dying myself but there's a couple here let's take those out 
and there's also a strong captain walking around again the amount of mobs here is just unbelievable but uh, killed him off as well there's another set of tools there and of course the only tools the last set of tools is in the corner right there but here are the snipers and um, yeah this is rather difficult it really is just cannot do it without dying I even buff up here And let's do it. Let's rock and roll. If you want a four, I need a four. Here they go burning me down. I try. But, unfortunately, I fail. So, boo. So yeah, back we go to take off the rest. Now if you can do that, and you can take a video of it, that'd be great. I'd love to watch a video of you doing doing these snipers on your own um, without dying a lot so but it doesn't end there the difficulty doesn't end there if you think that was the hard if that was hard and, and really difficult to get through you, you were right but the fun also continues when we get inside the mason uh, house on a mason faction building, whatever you want to call it. So he's dead at last, and that was the sniper mission done. And let's uh, go in to the building now. Oh no, get the other, of course, get the other tools first. The last one of those. There we are. And then we're uh, off to. Uh, building and there are loads in here and to be honest I didn't really want to fight anyone I've been pretty, pretty tired by this point so I've just well, I've just run straight through but then there were three here <laughs> and there's a, a patrolling captain and what I didn't know is you hit one captain and another two come along. There they come. So there's you hit one captain, then two more captains come. So it might be best just to take those out. And they're all patrolling, so they all run from wherever they are. So that was another kind of nice surprise that this gave me. Completely crazy um, how difficult this was and how difficult it was to navigate. Loads of thinking on your feet. But they did promise it would be more difficult, and uh, absolutely it is. If you haven't got your wits about you, if you can't think on your feet, then you're going to die. And, okay, there's not a great deal of punishment here for dying. It's just a pain to go all the way back. But uh, And it's the last little surprise from Turbine. Here's the end boss. So I just sort of run up to him, and there's two people waiting for me behind the door. <laughs> so... Just as a nice little kind of surprise, they uh, take me out. So let's deal with the big guy, and let's get out of here, really. Because, uh, yeah, to be honest, by this time I've had a bit of enough. I was being sort of battle-weary. But I had to do it because I really, really uh, want the uh, Liberator, Hunter Liberator, Dalamroth Teal Armor, and... Now I have it. So let's leave instance. And um, go back to Dol Amroth. And yeah, we'll start to say goodbye. So this will be the last faction, as I said before. Straight after this one goes live, there'll be uh, Liberator Armour. 
and I'll see you later, okay? Bye-bye.